You'll want to restart your computer after you've installed the Google Backup and Sync utility. Then in this video, we're going to configure the Google Drive Backup and Sync utility for the first time. The welcome window will be similar to the following and we click get started. Enter in your G Suite or Gmail account and verify your account with two-step verification. Once you're signed in, click got it. This next step, you're going to choose what you want to sync to Google Drive on the web. So you'll select all the folders on your laptop choose whether you want your photos and videos to upload in high quality or original quality and choose whether you want to upload to Google Photos as well. If you're limited to bandwidth, choose network settings here and set your limits appropriately. When you're done, click OK and we'll choose next to choose what to sync from Google Drive. These settings choose what you want downloaded from your Google Drive on the web to this laptop. You can choose to sync everything or just what's in my drive. When you're ready, choose start. Based on your preferences, your Google Drive sync utility will begin syncing immediately. Here, you can monitor the progress of its sync. When you click the icon, you'll see its full status and links to quickly get to Google Drive on your laptop, Google Drive on the web, and Google Photos, and the menu with your sync preferences. You'll always be able to change its preferences by clicking back on the backup and sync utility icon, then choosing the menu in settings and preferences. The first tab, My Laptop, is everything that's syncing to Google Drive on the web. And Google Drive shows everything that's syncing from Google Drive on the web. And Settings is where you can disconnect your account. 